Well, welcome back. Well, the sneaker market is heating up. Last year alone, the athletic footwear industry grew by 8%. It generated $17 and a quarter billion dollars in revenue. The secondary market for sneakers is estimated to be worth more than a billion dollars. It's even hotter than the pre-IPO Facebook shares. Joining us right now is sneaker con founder and stadium goods partner, Yu Ming Wu. Yu Ming, good to see you. Thank you so good much for joining you. us. Thank you. So what's going on with the sneaker world? Tell us how more and more people are just sliding into the market for sneakers. Sure. I mean, like, sneakers have been popular among young men all through the years, and now they've become very, very collectible. And why is that? Is there, is there something that happened to make sneakers become collectible? Sure. We have a lot of interesting designers like Kanye West or Air Jordan, and here we have NMN sneaker. So you're yeah. saying that these sneakers were designed by Kanye West? They're designed by Kanye West. Oh, yep. let, let's see Kanye's yep. designs here. Mm -hmm. Cool. Um, okay. So why is it so special that Kanye designed this? Well, Kanye is probably one of the most influential, influential musicians uh, of the moment, and he's designed something with, with Adidas, and all of the young men want to wear his sneakers. Now, this yeah. one, Nat, yeah. our fabulous uh, cameraman, mm -hmm. just told us this is $23,000. Correct. This pair of sneakers. Yeah. Why? Uh, it's designed by Eminem. Um, he designed this with Air Jordan, and he's given only to his friends. So for you and I to get a pair, we either have to be his friends or pay $23,000 for them. Wow. Yeah. So what but but twenty three thousand mm -hmm. dollars because he designed it. I mean what I mean this is not real rare. silver. Is there anything sure. special about this? It's the rarity of the sneakers. There I is see. very limited pairs. There's a few hundred pairs out there. And again, he only gave them to his friends. Okay. Yeah. And so how many are there? Four hundred pairs. Four hundred friends, yep. okay. Uh Pharrell N M D, what's that one? This is the Pharrell M M D. I feel like he always yeah. wears these. He does. Pharrell he wears Williams. them a lot, yeah. and he loves them. And he's this is the, one of the most popular sneakers at the moment. What? How much is this one? This is about twelve hundred dollars. Okay. Yep. And um, how did you get these guys to start designing these? Well, I mean, um, since the Air Jordan model, right. we've seen um, endorsements from athletes, and more recently with musicians. Um, so over the years, we've seen we've seen just a very a large amount of uh, popular musicians and athletes design sneakers. All right, how about the Yeezy Boost 750? Yes, this is the Yeezy Boost 750. This is actually the very first sneaker that Kanye That's designed with. Velcro. Okay. Yep. Cool. The, Kanye designed with Adidas, and this was the first sneaker that came out. It came out uh, during Valentine's Day, actually. Huh. Yeah. And that's five thousand dollars. Five thousand dollars, yes. But the retail price is three fifty. Yep. So j what's the wh what sent it all the way up to five thousand? Well, there's probably two, three million people who want the sneakers. Okay. And there's probably a few hundred thousand out there. That is so cool. Yep. Sneaker con getting bigger than ever. The convention is this weekend at the Javits Center in New York. You went from attracting about five thousand people per event to twenty thousand. Mm -hmm. Sneaker con is a big event now. Tell yes. us about it. Sure. So SneakerCon, we've actually started in Times Square with a small space. Our first event, we had 600 people, and now we're at the Java Center, and we're going to have 20,000 people there this weekend. That is a big deal. Yeah, How do you get the word out to go to SneakerCon? Uh, we have a large amount of Instagram followers. We have 2 million followers okay. on our Instagram account, and all together, we actually have about 10 million followers. How did you, how did you get into the sneaker business? Uh, you know, just through the love of, love of watching the game. I've watched actually Michael Jordan play back in the day, and uh, since then, I've been, I've been in love with sneakers. Wow, and yeah. Michael Jordan has been such a success at it. I mean, give me a break. Exactly. What about this one? I like that. I think these might be my favorite. This is the very, very popular Adidas NM it's probably one of the most popular sneakers out it's there right now. It's a nice now. sneaker. Now, is this yeah. a comfortable sneaker? It's an extremely comfortable sneaker because of the boost sole. Yeah. It's a prime knit upper, which is very flexible, and it has great colors, easy to wear. Yeah, that's why I like it. I like the color. Yeah. $850, um, and the retail price is $170. Good stuff. Yu Ming, yeah. thanks so much. Thank you. Uh, good luck at SneakerCon. You, thank you.